Hello and welcome, my name is Oliver and today we are playing Frostpunk. I know next to nothing about this game, but it looked interesting. I've seen one video and yeah, let's jump into it and see if it's something that I like to play. We roam the still, cold world. No horizon in sight. The rulers of old stripped of pride and glory. It feels as yesterday we were turning the wheels of progress. Until the frost stopped it all. Suddenly, without a warning. When tides had changed, they changed for all of us, no matter wealth or class. We've lost our world to snow. And with it, our last traces of humanity. We bid farewell to plenty. For those who remained, came the time to adapt. We decided to leave our homes and head north. We roamed for weeks, maybe months, leaving behind all the things we once believed had made us. It was hope that pushed us forward. Slowly, step by step, we knew the cost of our journey, and we paid the price a hundred times. Finally, the time has come to build the last city on Earth. A new home. We fled flo Blah. I can't talk today, sorry. We fled, fled from London and crossed the sea to reach the frozen north. On the way our convoy was hit by a blizzard and scattered. A handful of us managed to reach the site of this generator, only to find it frozen solid and abandoned. Why is no one here? Did any of our people survive the blizzard? Are there any others out there? Whatever we do, we should expect the worst now, that the world as we know it has crumbled. Well, this starts off uh, depressing. We have to survive. Yes, we do. <coughs> Certainly looks pretty. Fight the cold. We need to get the generator working. It provides heat and power to other buildings. Without it, we'll freeze to death. Stockpile some coal and start the generator. <coughs> How? Okay, I can move the camera with WASD. Okay, that seems simple enough. Where? Is that coal? No. Okay, I, um, the game doesn't tell me much right now. <laughs> kind of interesting. Wood crates, wood crates, steel wreckage. Come on, we're in England. There's coal everywhere. Coal. Build a coal mine here to start extraction. I assume that's... Tick. Workshop. I need a coal mine. Where? I'm... I have no idea. It's a gathering post, but that's not a... Hold on. 
okay. My people here were already on the way. Resources and workforce. Let's read a little. Resource management is crucial to the city's survival. You need coal to powder generator, wood and steel are necessary for construction and research. Okay. Steam cores are a key part of advanced buildings. Raw food is used to prepare food rations. Later in the game, what types of resources? Blah blah blah. Most buildings require you to assign people to work there. Kind of makes sense. Certain buildings only employ engineers and others only employ workers. To assign people to work, click on a workplace and use the assignment panel. Okay, is this a workplace? No, it's a coal deposit and I need a coal mine. <coughs> okay, can I just click on... Okay. Oh, I can't build a mine yet. I have to. Oh, so there's a coal deposit and there is a coal pile. Okay, I got it. Okay, got like, I don't know, five people on it. I don't know how much is good and how much is bad. My people make the turn, the journey. <coughs> Sorry, I'm having a bad time lately. The snow looks really cool. So these guys are gathering coal now, which I need to turn the generator on. I can fast forward this. Let's go fast. It's a shame I can't zoom in anymore. <laughs> Paul Liveridge, alone in this world. Oh, this guy has a spouse and children. Oh, this woman, sorry, I didn't read the name. Biggest concern is lack of shelter. Well, yeah, kind of makes sense, doesn't it? Discontent is at a real low level considering we're standing around in the freezing cold so how do i okay we need yeah let's just build how many people do i have total Okay, I have 80 homeless people, so I need 8 of these houses or tents. I don't have the space for that. It costs 10 wood. I have 10. That's not enough. Okay, frozen trees. I need a sawmill for that. Okay, so I can't get wood apparently. Let's get more people on resource gathering. I don't know if I need steel yet, but I'm just gonna collect some because I can. Okay. There's wood crates. Crates of construction wood that's ready to use. Okay, okay, yeah, let's let's get that because that's important. When can I turn on the generator? Um, okay, I... Oh! I turned it on. Nice! I don't know if that was a good idea, but let's see what happens. <laughs> so this is definitely a slower style game, more of a management thing. So this episode, this first episode, um, is just going to be a, a, a rather short one. And we can see later if I'm going to play more of it. Okay, 
do we have people why is nobody running here oh we are running really low on coal okay let's shut down the generator again okay i need a lot more coal if i want to have this thing running in any sort of way okay i don't think i'm gonna get people away from steel why is nobody illness and healthcare and speed up time with, yeah i know i can speed up time construction streets buildings it's conditional placement i i've never heard that before all buildings must be connected to the generator by a street in order to function okay that makes sense our generator is the heart of the city and the only source of heat in this frozen hole. You should turn it on as soon as you stockpile enough coal, which I didn't, so yeah, bad idea. The generator heats a circular zone around it, consuming at least 6 units of coal per hour. You can research generator upgrades that raise the heat output, expand the heat zone and reduce coal usage. Okay, seems like something I should do. The temperature inside the building depends on the power signal to generate heat zone. Condition outside. There are six temperature levels. Okay. Okay. So number six. I need a medical post. Oh. Okay. Those are stockpiles. Where? Oh, this is cold. Okay. Okay, we have sick people. Let's build. We don't have enough wood. <laughs> God damn it! I th don't think I'm gonna survive very f long in this. Is it because it's night that nobody is going out and, you know, collecting the coal we need? Yeah, generators start. Brilliant. Collect coal. Otherwise I can't do anything. Apparently it's minus 20. Oh, temperature. Wow, nice. Okay, that's cool. We're doing fine, all things considered. No, you're not. Society has collapsed. Uh, a word of advice. Critical shortage. The number of sick, sick people is rising and we don't have enough materials to build a medical post. Perhaps a short, short burst of effort could help us gather the necessary resources. Open the book of laws. <laughs> Great. Let's play lawmaker emergency shift sometimes we have to concentrate on the task at hand at the cost of everything else or die after introducing this law another one can be passed okay new ability you can force workers in any facility to work for the next 24 hours discontent will rise slightly but i kind of need it especially during the night Work, work, work until you die. Yeah, well, if you don't work, you're gonna die because you're gonna freeze to death. I know people aren't happy, but I mean, what the hell am I supposed to do? I need them to, yes, thank you, go out there and get coal for crying out loud. And yeah, they're getting wood too. I need that. Building abilities. The city wakes up at 6. People have some free time until the work shift starts at 8, unless there's construction work to do. After they finish their shift at 1800, they are free to help with construction again, which can keep them up well past midnight. You can extend the 10 hour working shift if you sign certain laws, which I just did. Building abilities. You unlocked a new building ability by assigning a law. Building abilities can affect societies, society in many ways. Each has a cooldown and many also a cost. Okay. What? K. 
can I get? Well, nothing because I don't have any wood. Come on. Time to get to work. Oh, temperature will drop significantly because minus 20 degrees Celsius isn't significant enough apparently. Yes, grab wood. I should have started grabbing the wood from the start, but I didn't know. I'm new to this game. I, I want to zoom in more to see more details, but I can't. Okay, we're getting wood, we're getting coal. Start to generate a... Yes. Okay, now I can build medical post. Yes, we definitely need that. Okay, things are not great, but they're not terrible. Not quite terrible yet. We are slowly getting going. It seems like a very interesting, but a very slow, at least in the beginning, moving game. So yeah, let me know if you want to see more. I definitely want to play more. It's a so far laid back game, I like that. And I think it's gonna get very controversial later on, as I've seen in uh, the one video I watched. So, yeah, I'm interested in more. Let me know if you think the same. Um, yeah, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Oliver here at Vienna Gamer, and I will see you in the next video.